Are you thinking about getting your real estate license in Connecticut? If so, you've landed on the right video because I'm going to lay out the steps on how you can get started on that process right here, right now. My name is Tyler Royke. I help real estate agents and brokers personally develop, achieve higher levels of success in their businesses, and ultimately move closer towards their purpose in life. And so the first thing you'll wanna know about getting your real estate license in Connecticut is there are two prerequisites. One, you'll need to be 18 years of age or older in order to get issued a license. And then two, you'll need to have a social security number. And as long as you meet those requirements, we can get started with step one. Step one is to complete the six 60 hours of required coursework in real estate principles and practices. And if you're looking for a place you can get started with that, I'll have a link in the description below to help set you on the right path. Step two is to apply for your real estate salesperson license. You're going to want to complete the notarized application available through PSI. And with that application, you're also going to want to pay your fees, which includes the $285 initial licensing fee, an $80 application fee, and a $20 guarantee fund fee. Step three is to schedule, take, and pass the state licensing exam. Step four is to obtain sponsorship from a licensed real estate broker. Now, I'm not going to go into detail on exactly how to find the best possible fit for yourself in this video however I will have another video on my channel to help guide you through that process if you'd like to check that out step five is an important one not to forget and it's continuing education so once you have your license once you're up and running you're going to want to make sure that you meet the requirements in order to renew it and the requirement in Connecticut is 12 hours of continuing education every even year going forward. So make sure you knock that out. And now that you know exactly how to get your real estate license in Connecticut, there's only one question that remains. Are you going to get started and get after it? If so, hit that subscribe button so that I may stay connected with you on the journey ahead and share more to help you along that journey. And if you'd like to learn more about what partnering with the real estate brokerage I'm affiliated with would look like for you, check out the description below. You'll find my email there. And if you shoot me an email, I'd be more than happy to learn more about your goals with getting started in the business and see if it would be the right fit for you. And if so, I'd be more than happy to make an introduction for you. And beyond that, if there's anything I can do to help you now or in the future, feel free to leave me a comment below or reach out. If you enjoyed the video, you already know what to do. Hit that subscribe button and I'll look forward to seeing you on the next video.